Pokemon Go is causing people in the U.S. to act really American. As Pokemon Go fever is spreading across the U.S., so too are accidents and all-round craziness caused by the ridiculously popular mobile app. People are even willing to risk their lives to play the game. 21-year-old Michael Baker was out playing the game in Forest Grove, Oregon, around 1 a.m. on Monday morning when he was stabbed. He ran into someone he thought was playing the game, but when he asked him if he wanted to battle, the stranger stabbed him in the shoulder. But rather than go to the hospital to get treated, he continued playing Go instead. Weatherman Bobby Deskins with WTSP-10 in Florida was live on air when news anchor Allison Croft walked right across the set in front of him and his weather map while looking for Pokemon. One Brooklyn player was playing in Prospect Park at night and walking towards a lure while live streaming when he was smart enough to fall into a lake. An upstate New Yorker was playing the game in Auburn on Tuesday night when he drove off the road and slammed right into a tree. Luckily, the driver was not seriously hurt, although the same can't be said for his car. A 15-year-old Pennsylvania girl was hit by a car on Tuesday around 5 p.m. after crossing a busy highway after she had just found a Pokemon. Wonder how long it'll take before Pokemon Go claims its first fatality. Bets anyone?